Mr. Chen Sharma. Sir, self-employed persons account for around 8 to 10 percent uh, of working residents, and with the rise of the gig economy, may well increase significantly in the future. The Ministry has indicated it accepts the Tripartite Working Group's recommendation of a contribute-as-you-earn model for MediSafe, whereby contribution to the self-employed person's MediSafe account of CPF is required as and when a service fee is earned. As the Ministry further studies its implementation, could the government also look into more ways uh, to encourage gig workers to make further voluntary contributions to their CPF by providing them with strong incentives to do so. Uh, there is substantial evidence from public policy efforts that uh, positive actions can be induced through non-compulsory incentive mechanisms. For instance, uh, could a default be established uh, where CPF deductions beyond MediSafe initially match uh, those of regular economy workers with the same job profile, but being non-binding would permit opting into a lower amount. Alternatively, could um, gig workers receive information in their CPF statements about typical contributions by regular economy workers in comparable employment circumstances to encourage them to follow the social norm? Self-employed persons typically face short-term cash flow needs, which may trump their longer-term economic interests in saving for future retirement. Could the government look into offering incentives for self-employed persons who voluntarily contribute to their ordinary special or retirement accounts, including favorable tax treatments when they do so? Thank you.